This is the Big O Show. This is the Big O Show. Big O, you need to move on from Tua. We can't keep living off of hope. Right. And Daniel, you need to come to reality. Last 25 years. Anybody play like that? <laughs> Daniel, you know what you need to do? Stop being incredibly stupid and ignorant. That's what you need to do, my man. Right? Because all of you that say that, you know, let's just get into this. Every time you guys just say, hey, let's move on from Tua, Daniel, you sound like a fucking idiot. Like a goddamn moron. How's that, Daniel? How do you like that one, Daniel? You sound like a freaking idiot. That guy's played better than anybody's ever played here since Marino. Like a thousand times better. Missing games and everything. He's a thousand times better. And you want to get rid of the guy that plays better than anybody you've ever had here since Marino. No, dude, you keep him. If you can find somebody better that can stay healthy, then yeah. But every one of you that just says, oh, you got to move on. You got to forget about it. We got to cut him. You got to let him go. You sound so incredibly stupid. It's, it's moronic. Go look at the stats. Go look at the top quarterbacks in the league. The guy's missed a bunch of games, and he's still one of the best quarterbacks in the league. Every time you guys say that, you sound like a bunch of dumbasses. For 25 years, you get John Beck and Pat White, and you want to get rid of this guy. Like, you know, it's wow. You know? It really is. There's a reason why so many people are stupid in this country and they believe a bunch of crap and they fall for a bunch of crap like you, Daniel. Because there's a lot of you that aren't very bright. Really. You're not smart at all. You know, all you have to do is look at the last 25 years. You have anybody that's played like this at all? At any point? No one. Most of the quarterbacks in the NFL have not played like two of this year. I, I mean, it is, it is incredibly stupid and ignorant every time somebody says that. Because you really don't look at reality. You don't look around you where your team has stood for 25 years. They can't find a guy that can hit the side of the ocean. Meanwhile, here's a guy that could come back from 21 down in Baltimore and beat Buffalo. And he would have beat Buffalo again if it wasn't for Mike McDaniel and Tyreek Hill and Trent Sherfield. I mean, my God, dude. It's it's really like it, it, it's just incredibly stupid. You know, you want to tell me you want to get rid of Tua because we got a better quarterback? I, I'm not going to tell. I'm not going to argue with you. But you want to get rid of a guy without having a guy in place? You're an idiot. Happy Friday, Daniel. Yeah, Daniel. Big O, he can't stay healthy. So what, dude? I get it. But when he's healthy, he's the best quarterback you've had. And you wouldn't even have the eight wins if you don't have him somewhat healthy. You would be even worse. Teddy Bridgewater. Yeah, you know why, Daniel? You're one of the idiots that said Teddy Bridgewater was going to take his job. That's why. You're one of the idiots that thought Skyler was the starter. That's the problem. Because if you're this stupid, you're that stupid. Okay, Daniel? If you're this much of a moron then you're the moron that thought Teddy Bridgewater could play at a high level. You're the moron that thought seventh-round pick Skylar Thompson was the real starter. Because if you're this freaking stupid, you're that stupid. This is the Big O Show! This is the Big O Show!